Managing privilege access is no longer optional, but most platforms weren't built for small IT teams or their budgets. Devolution's PAM takes an IT-led approach. It provides right-sized essentials that can be deployed in days, not months. Run it with the team you already have, produce audit-ready evidence, and finally gain visibility and control from day one. It's everything IT teams need to stay productive and secure without breaking the bank. No, it's not too good to be true. It's IT-led PAM. Let's see it in action. Before we can control privilege access, we first need a secure place to store those credentials. That's where vaulting comes in. Using Remote Desktop Manager, here's one of our PAM vaults, a centralized place to store and secure privilege accounts. By centralizing them into one vault, your team gains full visibility over who has access to what, without credentials floating around, shared spreadsheets, or text files. Access is managed through role-based access control, synchronized with Active Directory or Entra ID. You can assign permissions by user, group, or role, giving you precise control over who can view, use, or manage each credential. For environments that are air-gapped and don't use Active Directory, Devolution's PAM can run entirely standalone, with local users, groups, and vaults managed directly inside Devolution Server. Next, Discovery. With Devolution's PAM, you can create account providers that connect to your existing directories, like Active Directory, Azure AD, or others, to automatically scan and identify privileged accounts. Once discovered, importing them into your vault is just a few clicks away. From there, they inherit all PAM controls, password rotation, detailed logging, and access policies. By centralizing discovery, every privileged account across all platforms is secured, audited, and governed from one place. Now let's see how PAM fits into your daily IT work. Privileged accounts can be checked out directly or linked to remote sessions. Each time an account is accessed, PAM triggers a request and approval workflow, which can be automated by policy to avoid workflow bottlenecks. In this example, our user Kelly needs to launch an RDP session using a privileged account. When she initiates the session, she's prompted for duration, justification, and optional just-in-time elevation, which temporarily adds Kelly to an AD group, granting the required privileges only for the approved window, then automatically reverting them. Her approver, Maurice, gets a notification by email, inside RDM, or through the Devolutions Workspace app. Here, he'll review, adjust if needed, and approve the request. Back to Kelly, she's been notified that a request was approved and she launches the session, which injects the credentials on her behalf, never exposing the password. Because she's performing elevated tasks on a higher risk endpoint, her session is automatically recorded through the Devolutions Gateway for auditing. In her PowerShell session, she runs a few commands, which return detailed information about the system's configuration. We'll let her finish her work. Now that she's finished and checks the account back in, the credential is rotated, the activity is logged, and any temporary permissions are restored to their previous state. Because Kelly connected via the Devolutions Gateway, her entire session was recorded automatically. Admins like Maurice can replay sessions, review command logs, and export reports for audits or compliance checks. And since PAM's logs are immutable, every approval, rotation, and session event remains verifiable. Together, the Gateway and PAM activity logs provide end-to-end -end visibility, from access requests to password rotation, ensuring your privilege activity is always traceable, compliant, and under control. So that's Devolution's PAM. Vaulting and discovery, session management, approval workflows, and auditing, built to give you everything you need without the headache. It's practical, affordable, and IT-led. That's the Devolution's way. Now it's time for you to try it for yourself.